welcome back to episode 2 of Rolex series. So we have a new thing. Yeah, so this is a new episode, I mean a new series on my channel that will document the life of a newly married couple and what, it, what it's like, our challenges, decisions, investments. So anyway, yeah, mostly about life. So anyway, remember in our last episode, we were asking for your help to help us decide which condominium we, you would like for us to invest in. So we reviewed the four condominiums again, the computations, and we have finally come up with a decision. Yay. It's our first real real estate investment. Our first real real estate investment. Yeah, so what made us what made us decided to invest in Vida instead of others? Okay, so that's the condo we decided to invest in. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. We decided we decided to invest in Aspira Towers in Tower Two. So why did we decide to invest in Aspira versus all the other condominiums? So why don't you share that? Yeah, at first, uh, number one is what we, we decided to invest in Avida is because of the future prospect of the project, especially if it's brand and it's a well-known developer. It usually has a great capability, a great uh, track record in providing quality, uh, quality buildings. And if you look at their presence in Manila, the, the price of their Condominiums or all their projects are pricey, so it's one of the decisions that we come up. I mean, it's one of the reasons why we come up with the decision. And another thing is, uh, as I read a lot of investment news in newspapers, especially about the and the Oro, we also got hold of the news that Capital is talking to Ayala and we're banking on on that thing that Ayala will get the capital grants as well as the city jail and will put additional buildings there that will rise up the value of Abida. So overall, that's I think the main reason, unless it's because of the flexible payment terms that uh, Ayala or Abida gives us, it's uh, on point on our budget and our schedule. It's 36 months to pay. Yes. So we get to pay the 20% equity or the down payment in 36 months at no interest. And the remaining 80% will be financed by the accredited bank, which is BPI, can be BPI. Or so, but that will be in four years. At least for the next four years, we will be paying with no interest. We still have a lot of time. We have a lot of time to improve our cash flow. Before we need to, we will need to apply for back payments. So again, the reasons why we chose Aspira Towers is the brand, because I'm very particular, being a real estate broker for the past seven years, I'm very particular with how a developer treats their projects, not just the projects they're developing, but the projects that they have already turned over. So I really check to see if after turnover, do they still take care of the project, or do they just leave it? That's the most important thing. Yes, that's the most important thing, because real estate is a long-term investment, so you don't just look at the construction phase or the project, but how it will do once it's turned over to the unit owners or to the homeowners. So, Abida has consistently created projects that have increased in value, like BGC, Makati, New Valley, and a lot of other projects. They really take care of their building, especially in like one that they showed us the first condominium, which still stands today. And it's been, I don't know how many years, maybe 50 years or more. Yeah, so they are a good developer with projects that consistently increase in value. They have a strong brand, and I like the feel of, of Avida in general, their marketing, their staff, how they treat their customers. Like, we got to meet with Miss Kitty and Miss Amy. So Miss Amy is the operations manager for Avida, for Visayas and Mindanao. And she actually took us to lunch today. And it was a very pleasant interaction. And she talked to us about the different projects of 
Ayala and what they have in store. So yeah, that really helped us make our decision also. And Miss Kitty has been very, very helpful and accommodating to us in the process. And yeah, the payment service. So we didn't want to get to cash out a lump sum of money because we have plans to expand our business. So they allowed us, as I mentioned, to pay the down payment in 36, 36 months. So that's three years. So that's why we were able to reserve it. So for those who commented on our last video, thank you so much for your for your advice. And if any of you is considering investing in a condo in a Spirit Towers, do let me know and I would be happy to help you.